sitting down today with Western Michigan head men's soccer coach Stu Riddle and just talking a little bit today about your incoming class. You just signed your 2010-2011 recruiting class. You're bringing in 10 newcomers and adding two transfers. What are some of your overall thoughts on this recruiting class? It's a class we're uh, extremely excited about. Um, you know, we've put a lot of, of hard work in over the course of the last 12 months since I took took the job here into this class and, and really making sure that we are bringing in um, not only the right type of player um, that is going to fit um, what we're looking to do with the program here at Western Michigan, but also the right type of person. And uh, a lot of hard work has gone into, into background research. Um, academics need to be strong also, and uh, we feel very uh, confident that we've hit um, all of our targets and goals, as well as all of the, uh, the positions that we needed to fill as well um, with this, uh, this group of 12 players that's going to be joining us. So I think overall it's, uh, it, it's a very encouraging sign that we've been able to attract this level of player to Western Michigan um, so early uh, in my career here, and we're, we're really excited to get them in Broncos uniforms and, and see them uh, play on the field. And you're heading into your second season as the head coach here at Western Michigan, so this is really your first true recruiting class. Um, what do you look for when you're out there recruiting? You know, I think uh, it, it can vary from position to position. Obviously, the attributes that we're going to be looking for out of a central defender are going to be different from that of a goalkeeper or, or even a forward. Um, I think the overarching guidelines that, that, um, that we look for when we're out there recruiting are the, uh, the, the tactical and technical abilities of the, uh, the prospect and also the, the physical capabilities of the prospect as well. So um, while it can vary you know, quite a lot position to position, they're, they're the three main ones that, that we look for. And of course, like I touched on previously, we've got to make sure that we're bringing in that right type of person. So academics are, are very important to us as well. Um, three of the group of 12 will be going into the, the, the Honors College here. So uh, we're very encouraged uh, about this group uh, overall. And this new group of 12, uh, you know, how do they, con they complement the core group that you have returning from last year's team? Well, I think it, it's a case of them just uh, adding to what we've got rather than replacing um, some of the guys that are already here. Uh, we've got a small group that we're working with now in the spring, really developing um, how we want them to play, um, both defensively and offensively. Uh, they've been buckling down and, and working really hard and really understanding the concepts that we're looking from them. But uh, this new group... That, that is coming in it is sort of adding to the quality that we've got remaining here uh, within the program. So I'm very excited about that. You know, um, we had six or seven guys that, uh, as freshmen last year, started an awful lot of games, and uh, it, it's up for grabs right now with the incoming group of 12. I think any of them could come in and start based on what we know about them. And you had a successful campaign in 2009, finished third in the MAC during the regular season, which tied uh, one of the best finishes in school history made it to the tournament semifinals. Uh, Western Michigan produced the nation's leading scorer in uh, goals per game. Overall, where do you see this program headed? Well, I think the important thing is that we get progression and, and, and that we keep heading uh, in a forward direction. Obviously, um, last year's conference play was very good, um, given the fact that it was our first season together. Um, you know, I, I think the example of Saeed Suleiman Ababa, who, as you referenced, finished as the nation's top goal scorer in, in goals per game, um, is the shining example of, of what someone can get out of this program if they want to, if they really want to buckle down and work hard and listen to what the staff have got to say. Um, the rewards can be, can be endless. So we want progression. We want this group to move forward. We want a better um, out-of-conference out of season next year. It took a little bit um, of time for us to get going. And I think uh, next year it's important that the players understand that um, some of the other MAC conference teams will now be looking to get some revenge on us and, uh, and the chance to, to not take us lightly as they may have done last year. So it's going to be an important season for us, and uh, we really believe that the players we've got coming back and the players that we've now got joining us are going to help us be more successful than we, than we were last season. All right, Coach Riddle, thanks for taking time to sit down with us today, and best of luck on uh, your upcoming season. Wonderful. Thank you very much.